Welcome to Pro Practice, your guide to refine, enliven, and illuminate the piano repertoire. I'm Josh Wright, and today's episode is the second video in the intermediate arrangement of Mussorgsky's Pictures at an Exhibition. So my a student in New York, he's an intermediate adult student, and he said, I love pictures at an exhibition, but there's no way I'm going to play that in the next couple of years. Is there any way we could find an arrangement of this? And we searched, and there was just garbage out there. There wasn't anything really great. So he commissioned one of my previous students, who's a composer and a great pianist, A.J. Long, um, to write an intermediate arrangement of this. And A.J.'s done a great job. He's um, cut down sections where need be, so it's not going to be a 30-minute <laughs> piece anymore. Um, they're definitely approachable, and he simplified a lot of the textures without losing um, at, you know, so much of the beauty of the piece like we saw in other arrangements. He was able to maintain the integrity of the music, which I really appreciate. Today, uh, we're going to go over uh, dynamics, fingering, pedal, uh, voicing, interpretation, all those types of things. Um, and this will cover, today's video will cover the gnome and the promenade, the second one, um, which is part of the gnome. So just a quick side note as well. Uh, I went through a little period there, like with the double thirds etude video, um, where I wasn't doing overhead angles uh, because it just took me so dang long to edit everything. I was having no time to practice or anything like that. So I have hired a video editor now, so we're back to the overhead angles. So hopefully you guys um, enjoy that so you can see everything perfectly clearly. Other side note, I will post a slow version, a slowed down version of the double thirds etude uh, for each of you as well, in case you're wondering about that. Okay, here we go. Overhead angle is what I meant. So I'm just gonna play through this. I'll play through it at like a medium tempo, just since I know that's gonna be more realistic for an intermediate player. And you can obviously play it as fast as you want. Like this would be fast. So he simplified that texture down. But I'm gonna just go a little bit slower, just so it's a little bit easier to follow along. Here we go. By the way, uh, if you purchase the full tutorial of this video, um, it comes with the sheet music. There's also, if you don't want the tu full tutorial and you just want the sheet music, that's in the link below as well. So you can see both of those. It's a fun little um, truncation of the piece. And I think I missed a note over here. <laughs> um, that B flat. So if you're like, what the heck? Um, that's what happened. Okay, here is the promenade. goes into the next movement. Gorgeous arrangement, AJ. Very nice work. So let's go over um, 
let's just break this down maybe one or two lines at a time go over the fingering pedal everything uh, rather than doing the whole piece fingering whole piece pedal uh, so here we go five five four one two or four one three I might suggest a little more on the three just because you're gonna be doing Thank you so much for watching. As with all pro practice videos, the first section is free. If you'd like to view the rest of this video, you can click on the link in the description below. And I've also created a card a link at the top of this screen that you can click on for the video. Um, you'll also see, uh, you can visit my website for all the lessons. You can subscribe to my channel or you can view more videos over here. Thank you for joining me today. Good luck in your practice sessions.